Hey everyone, it's Wendy at Mooty System here. You know, I'm often asked, why did I create Mooty System? Why did I make it? Well, you know what? I made Mooty System because I needed it. I needed it because I didn't have what I needed after I had my babies. My babies are 12 and 13 now. But when I had my daughter in 2005, nothing but nothing went quite the way it was supposed to. I was a super fit personal trainer at the time, literally training like six, seven clients a day, running, lifting right through my pregnancy. And not only was I a super fit personal trainer, but I was actually a pre and postnatal specialist. So I really thought I knew all this. I really thought I had it in the bag. Well, you know, the, the births did not go according to plan. I know I won't be alone on that one. The births did not go according to plan. Everything went wrong. I had massive hemorrhaging. And afterwards, I felt a feeling that I know is common to a lot of women after they have their babies, which is this feeling of your body having let you down, of having betrayed you, body shame. I did not feel good about what had happened. Nothing about my birth had felt instinctive or intuitive or any of those things that we're supposed to feel when we have our babies. And then only, well, less than two years after I had my daughter, my son was born and pretty much the same thing happened. Massive hemorrhaging, everything going wrong and just not feeling in any way the powerful, empowered, um, strong woman that I wanted to feel and that I was encouraging my, my clients to feel. And I felt around that time that what I was giving my clients, which was essentially what I've been trained to teach, I was a highly certified postnatal personal trainer, but something was missing. Something was just not working. Um, and I knew that somebody had to know the answers. I knew something else must be out there. Because around that time, and I know that others will relate to this, I mean, we look down at stretch marks or overhang or scars and it leaks or it hurts and we don't like it and we can't control it. I you know what we do is shut down. Do you know what I mean? We disconnect from the parts of our body that we don't like, the way they look and feel, and we can't control the way they look and, they look and feel. And we might pee a little or a lot um, when we sneeze or we laugh too hard. Sex maybe doesn't feel so great anymore. Maybe you're even feeling a pulling or a dragging sensation. Basically symptoms in the stomach, belly, pelvic region that just don't feel right. And that of course has knock-on effects, doesn't it? Because it's not just physical. Because when we don't feel good about ourselves, then that affects us emotionally and how we how we behave and, and, and what we feel capable and, and good about doing. So we undress in the dark and we cover our bodies. Maybe we feel ashamed or embarrassed and, and not good about looking at ourselves, naked maybe. You know, many of us, and I'm sure many can relate, maybe we even exercise or eat in a way that rather than nourishing and strengthening our body, is actually punishing it, punishing it for letting us down or, or not behaving or, or performing the way that maybe we think it should have done. And, and we see Instagram, don't we? We see social media and the articles and the never-ending reminders of what we're supposed to be and how we're supposed to look. And we don't want to keep looking because we know it's not real, but we can't stop. And what do we end up feeling? Just not hot enough, not like we're working hard enough, not together enough, not anything enough. And what happens with all of these symptoms, and these are, I'm talking physical symptoms, but emotional too, about our confidence and how we really feel about ourselves. And we settle, don't we? We're like, okay, this this is what it's like now. This is this is what happens when you have babies. We We put up with it. And very much media and even well-meaning friends or, or the, the medical industry, all sorts of places make us feel like that's what we should be doing, just putting up with it, this is normal, this is just like the way it is. And you know what, around that time, so like I say, like 12 plus years ago, I thought, hang on, I, I deserve better than what the fitness industry and the media are offering me. And this was my industry, remember? I mean, I was a personal trainer. I, I knew what I was talking about. But I felt that I deserved better. And I feel that you deserve better too. And 
This is why I made Mutu System. I first made it in 2009. It's now on its like fourth incarnation. It's a very different um, production to what it was in the early days. But my commitment to why I do it and why I did it has never changed. And because really around, around 10 years ago, I set out, I was like, okay, so who has the answers? to these questions because not only the women that I was working with as a, as a personal trainer, but also, um, you know, for myself by that point too, for myself, I was saying somebody must know the answers to this. Um, I was already an experienced trainer, but I knew that something was missing. And so I went out and studied and I searched for answers. And this, this is where Muti came from, guys. I, I searched in phys I looked in physical therapy, I learned more about biomechanics, as well as fitness, I started talking to pelvic health physiotherapists and physical therapists, to midwives and to surgeons and to sex therapists alongside postpartum exercise specialists. And over the years, I worked with hundreds of women, and then I worked with virtually since with thousands and now tens of thousands of women. And this is why Mutu exists. This is why it's there for you. It's because I want you to feel the very best you you possibly can. And I know that sounds a bit like a cliche, but I genuinely and passionate believe, passionately believe that every woman, every one of us deserves a body that works and that makes us feel good. We, need, we, we deserve that dignity, we deserve that pleasure. And I want you to feel supported every step of the way, and that's what we do at Mutu System, not only from the community of other customers and people doing it, but also by real experts, by my team, every step of the way. We want you to be able to live your life and do the activities physically and emotionally and with confidence that you really want to do. It's this is why we, we say you move to so you can. The so you can is whatever you want it to be. It might mean physical activity. It might mean jumping or sneezing or laughing without peeing. It might mean running a marathon. It might mean running a multinational company or the PTA or your household. Whatever it is you want to do, Mutu, so that you can.